Welcome to my hotel. Um, don't mind some of our rude patrons over here. They just don't know what they're going on about. Um, so yeah, if you haven't seen the last episode of Dead Island, this person over here, Mike, needs help rebooting the security system. So we sort of just need to go to all these computers in here and in here. And we just need to help him reset them. It's not too hard. He says it's just very time consuming. And there we go. There's two of them done. Because there was one out here that I needed to do. Yeah, we did that one. We've done this one. Now there should be one through here. And we also have an upgrade. I'll go with extra slots so I can hold more weapons. Okay, here's... Wait. Oh, there's another dude here. Okay. And he had 53... I mean, $33 on him. Okay, let's do this one. No. No, I hear you. Where did you even come from, sir? Okay, well, there's only one left, which is over here. There we go. That's all of the security systems. Now, something bad's gonna happen. I can feel it. I can feel it in my alive bones that something bad is going to happen. Okay, we've done it, Mike. You bloody made it? Good. The door to the parking lot is unlocked, and a large mm -hmm. part of the system is up and running again. I'm just worried about the power in the parking lot. Okay, uh, I think I'll be fine. It shouldn't be too bad. So yeah, we're actually, we're actually here because we need to find a giant truck to break down the uh, opening through a um, tunnel. So that's the whole reason we're actually here is to get a, a truck. And it sounds like there's a lot of friends. Yeah, there's a lot of people, friends, things down here. Well, there's the truck there, being guarded by a thug. Oh, my weapon's broken. That's why I didn't do much. Uh, threatening machete. Yeah, that's better. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Step who? Stay back. Oh right, yeah, I forgot. I can just do that. I completely forgot that I can do that. Um, that I can throw my weapons. It helps a lot when you're dealing with thugs. Anyway, here we come. Oh, it's a bank um, truck. Oh, a helicopter. Help people around the lighthouse? Okay, I guess we're helping people around the lighthouse again. You know what? Get in here. Get in. Oh, no. It's people at the light. It's just telling me all the quests that I can do. While I'm back in this place. Never mind. I don't need to do it. That's one of the side quests, though. I don't know if you actually need to help people at the lighthouse or not. It might. You might. I don't know. It hasn't said it's part of the main story, so. You know, hitting zombies doesn't even budge this thing. Well, then again, it makes sense that it wouldn't budge it because we are going to use this to, you know, bust down. Um. I think it's part of a tunnel, broken down tunnel that we're going to use. But you know, the visibility on this thing isn't great. I'm home. Mm, it doesn't quite feel the same when you're doing it with a giant truck. It feels better with the smaller trucks because they, they actually get speed or more speed, it feels like. So, what do you, what does everybody think? What do you think, Siminoi? Yeah, we got it, Siminoi. Good job. What are we doing now? I want to say so, but I was afraid it might not be there. You're giving me diamonds, which is nine hundred dollars in a month. Thank you, man. And what are we up to now? We heard somebody on the radio talking about a chopper going down. From what they said, the crash site's pretty close by. I mean, I saw Maybe the chopper. Check it out. I can do that because I even saw the chopper as we I came mean. out of the thing. Look for survivors first, and then see if there's anything in the wreckage worth saving. No, no, people then resources. Yeah, I just had a quick thought. While we're here, um, and since I got those diamonds and stuff, I am going to quickly sell some stuff to the dude in here. Like, a lot of my weapons I can sell to him. Oops, that's the buying. I do not want to buy from him. That would be bad. Yeah, look, we have 30, we have 43 <laughs> alcohol from the dudes there. Modification, diamonds is a modification. Oh, all of these are a modification. Oh, as in like all of these are four modifications. Okay, I guess I should maybe keep this. 
I guess we'll go and investigate that uh, crash. Okay, it's done the thing where it sent me up here again. When it would actually be faster to, to do it from another... I don't know. For some reason, when it wants me to go to the Darwin Bungalows, it sends me through this area for some reason. And I'm not 100% sure why. It's actually a little bit slower to do it this way. Oh, well, there's the helicopter wreckage. And... It's showing that we're here with some other people. Okay. Holy shit! Why did it look like the zombies were running from something? If zombies are running from something, that's never good. Careful. Watch it. They're dead. Something's dead. Oh, hey, bud. Um... What is that? Um... Do I th the bigger throw they my are. weapon at it? Noted. See those things? Either just run or throw my weapon at them. Hey, hey sir. My name is Nikolai. As you can see, this piece of shit helicopter that was supposed to get me off this fucking island crashed. Figures it wasn't Russian. Ah, of course, I we see. We need to get out of here, my friends. Soon this place will be swarming with those things. Before we crashed, I saw a bunker by the beach. Once inside, it would be a great place for us to hide. Very defensible. Unfortunately, it's surrounded by those infected freaks. If you can get us to the bunker, I guarantee I will get you off this goddamn island. I have actually seen that bunker. I tried going in there once, but you can't actually get in there. Now, let me really check this. Um, doesn't look like there's going to be anything of value left in this helicopter. I mean, yeah, there's definitely nothing left. Come on, Nikolai. Keep up. Come on. Keep those keep those feet moving. Oh, no, unless more things want to... Oh, they're coming from up here. Okay, I can... Why are they going for Nikolai? Oh, oh, God. Stop. Get away from him. At least he actually defends himself. Unlike some others. Still. This is actually pretty nice in here. You know, you have a way to go up. What have we got up here? Oh, it's actually quite spacious up here. And you can see What's to the outside here? world. Oh, what level is this? Level 3 pick lock. Damn it. Well, lock picking, sorry. And through here, we got everything you need. Plus an exit. Anyway. Spasible, there you go, friends. Nikolai. Here's a little something for your trouble. Ooh, what is it? A better homemade machete. And I only need to be level 12 for this one. How much does it cost to upgrade it? 176 to upgrade? You know what? Let's upgrade it. 200? Upgrade it. 500? Hmm, can't quite afford that. But the damage in the end will be 300 and something. So it'll be a pretty good weapon. Thank you for yeah, the weapon, sir. I think I'm going to go talk to Cinemoy, which I actually need to quickly check. I'm pretty sure there's fast travels in these uh, things. Either through here, which is it through here? No. But there is something down here. Oh, uh, uh, yep, take that. Where am I? This is like the bunker that we were just in, but a little bit different. Huh. So we went from here to here. Okay. I'm gonna head back to the other place and use a fast travel to get back to Cinemoy. Okay, well, we're here, so let's talk to Cinemoy. Every little bit helps us hang on a little longer. Thank you, Cinemoy. And what do you got? A shock... I'll take a shock mod. Now, I'll talk to you again while we're it's at it. It's a big, powerful truck, but we need to turn it into a bloody tank. We do. We need to reinforce it and make it unstoppable. You up for that? Of course I'm up for making a giant truck into a tank to make it unstoppable. Why wouldn't I, Cinemoy? Why wouldn't I? Yes. Good. There's a workshop not far from the lighthouse. You'll find what you need there. You know how to weld? 
Let's just pray the mechanic's still alive. I don't. Then. We'll need to find somebody else. I mean, he'll be alive. He might have made his own weapon and or something. And while we're here, hello, sir. I have no other use for alcohol. So, so here you go. I'm gonna need some, I'm gonna the amount of times I've heard him say this now, there should be some around here. I'm losing my mind. Because every time you want to complete the mission, you have to listen to him say that. Anyway, we got a decent amount of XP for him doing that. And we got some Molotovs. And actually, now that we've leveled up, um, before I spend my skill points, I can use the disabling homemade machete now. We'll equip that and change it out for that. And its durability is 68. Pretty good. And now skill. I'm going to start going into bleeding. Because I would like to start causing bleeding on things. Okay. Shock mod. I can use the machete and the sickle. And we have everything we need for it. So... The dependable machete is better. Just cost a bit more to upgrade it. So I think I'll put the shock on the dependable machete. Because when I get that up and going, it'll be very good. Okay, let's go and see if the... Uh, what's his name? is still at the place. And... See if he's willing to come and help us. I mean, I'm assuming they would be. Oh, I was about to take the uh, this normal car to do that mission. I need to take the big car. How could I be so dumb? Do the workshop? I can do that. Why are some of the zombies I need to take out behind this fence? Okay. I don't know. Either way. Oh, there we go. Now this is the disabling homemade machete, yeah. Really good. Hello, sir. Get in. Miss. Quick. Sir. Hey, uh, we need help. Uh, something with this. And also, what level do I need for this? Level two. Anyway. They can't help what they are. They sick in the head. I showed some compassion. I got bit. By tomorrow, I'll, I'll be one of them. Got maybe six hours left, probably less. But until then, I can still do some good, right? That is true. What do you want this thing to be? A rolling fortress, a, a homemade tank? I can add some armor or whatever. You want me to give it a try? Please do give it a try. We need to protect you while you're Absolutely. working. Absolutely. That doesn't seem now too hard. Talking. Make it so those bastards don't interfere, and I'll pimp your ride. Damn straight. I would love this ride to be pimped. I mean, look at it now. We need a before and after shot. So yeah, here's a before. And then we'll need to wait for him until we can do the after. So we just need to stand here and stop any from getting past. Right? Oh, I see he's making noise, which is going to, I guess, attract them. Oh, also, we'll also get a decent amount of money from this. Because we can just loot the bodies. How long is it going to take for him, I wonder? How many zombies are we going to have to deal with? Because we only had to really... Oh, God, I'm stepping in the goop. Oh, okay, so it needs us to walk over to where the flag actually is. The zombies to appear. Are you still coming at the right around the same time? Double kill. I did it. I'm doing quite well on decapitating them, if I do say so myself. Jesus Christ, she sliced and diced quite fast. Stay alert. Oh, something. I don't know what it said. Something that said something about Earl. Wait, did Earl turn? No. Real good. I'm done. It'll have to do. Okay, this is pretty good. It's a lot better than what it was. I mean I have seen better. One more but I've also seen a lot worse. My daughter can't stay here. What? Soon I won't be in my right mind. I don't want to hurt her. I think we'll that sounds fair. He can't protect her. Not like you can. I want you to take her. Uh, sorry, Bubba. No way. Hey. Is this what you need? Then give me what I need. What are you saying, Dad? I'm not going anywhere. No, honey, honey listen to me. You have to, honey. There's nothing for you here now. I'm not leaving you. Look, look at me. Look at me. It's very emotional. 
And this is how I want you to remember me. You promised me you'll take care of her. She'll come with us. Dad, no! Dad! I mean, he makes a fair point. Now, and don't you lose hope. I mean, apart from her staying Live safe, it's probably better that she remembers him as I human than what he will be. There we go. We've leveled up again. And I'm level 14 now. Let's go. Okay, well, I can now do level 2, so can unlock that one over there and I can now use the dependable machete all right now you're ready I am still my but stay safe don't take any stupid chances you die out there and our last chance to survive dies with you noted also that was a decent weapon wasn't it use diving knife yeah it does already does 209 damage okay this dependable machete I'm gonna upgrade and Upgrade one more time. There we go. The next upgrade costs a lot. Um, I can actually three more dollars and I uh, no five more dollars and actually actually afford it. But that will be three hundred and sixty something damage, and the durability will be eighty three, which will be good a good amount of durability. Because that's what I need on some of my sharp Daddy. weapons. More durability. Mom always wanted to come back here, but she never got the chance. We settled here after her death. The island helped him forget, and he poured his heart and soul into it. This is where my heart is, too. So, if we're supposed to help someone, let's just do it. Makes sense. Travel outside the resort uh, to find food, medicine, and weapons. Okay. Let's let's do it. Okay. All set? Let's go. I say we check out the church first. Anyone still alive would probably go there. I would. Makes sense. Okay. 800 meters. Let's get go. Oh god, it's so hard to see. But I guess let's get going. You know what this sort of <laughs> reminds me of? You know those glasses with little slits in them? It's sort of like trying to see out of them on a really bright day. I'm honestly not even really looking out these windows. I'm trusting the line more than I am trusting looking out the window. Like, under here, it's fine. It's just when it's like this, it's so bright. Oh, we're going to break this down, I think. I see. Okay. This area looks pretty, pretty cool, pretty neat. Oh, here comes the plan. Yes! That doesn't look very good at all. There's a hole in the back, which is good. I'm assuming it's weakness. But I have to deal with that. I feel like that's where it would be good to have a gun. But I do know. I don't like using guns, but I feel like a gun would, would be good against this thing. Or, you know, better against this thing. Oh shit, I forgot it charges. Well, I didn't forget. I just figured, you know. Okay, let's figure out how to deal with this thing. Okay, can I, does it hurt its friends? Seems it does. Maybe. Okay, you need it to make it run into a wall and then you can hit it in the back. So like that. And then get a few slices in and then run away. Okay. Miss again. You slices in. Oh. It's, dude, it wasn't even that bad. I die. I say he's not that bad and I die. <laughs> Probably should have worried about the other dude a bit more than the big one. The little ones are what get you. Because you spend all the time trying to get the big one. At least when we're in a confined area like that. Probably should worry about it a bit more. And we've still got my good, ma my good machete, so... Now, I'm pretty sure when that happens... You just lose a bit of money. They're attracting demons from all over the city. We did it. What do you mean? Hey down there. Open the gate. The guests are here. What? Oh, someone up there. Okay. Maybe you can figure out how to silence those blasted bells. 
Okay, maybe. Um, I leveled up. Okay, I'm going to go more bleeding. Because I would really like to have my enemies bleed. Okay, thank you for the warm welcome. That dude seems to be going a little... He, he's. I think it's because everyone's holding their ears. Because I'm guessing the bells have been going off for so long. Uh, hey, lady. Said you'd be coming. He One did? Of us, possessed by a demon, locked himself in the belfry. Please help us silence these bells. They are calling to the devil's disciples. Okay, I think I can do that real quick. I, While I'm here, let's go create. Let's go shock mod. Let's create the shock mod. Put it on the dependable machete. Which will do four and then whatever that is. Less, a little bit less durability, but that's fine. There we go. The shock mod has been added. Now, it looks a little bit different. You can see like all the wires and everything on it. Okay, I mean, I was about to say one good thing about them locking themselves away is, well, they locked themselves away. So I guess they knew something was going to happen or something bad was going to happen. Wait, how has the zapping gone so far? Was it 300 damage? Pretty good, might be in. Also, I found out I can literally just stay out of their range. That's that was my problem. I was getting in too close with them before. But I don't actually need to throw my weapon. It's more of a choice. Also, another blueprint mod. I would like to get toxic. What is? Can I put two mods on one weapon? Oh, I can't leave now. Okay. They've locked me in. Okay, I've got the church bell key or whatever it was. Oh. So we do this, and then we can turn on. Oh, it was just that thing there. Okay. Thank you. You saved us. Those You're welcome, Helen. Nearly pushed their way into the church, and Frank, his soul was lost to the beast. I mean, that thing out there—that's the worst one I've seen so far. And thank you for this mace. It looks very good. Now I don't know if I can put two mods on one weapon, because if not. The next best weapon I'm going to have to use it on. Because I can get extra toxin damage with the special that I... with well, Since I'm using the slicing lady. Okay. But I think I'm going to leave it here. Because we got quite a bit done. We've come into a new area. Which I still need to explore. Which I think we will leave till next episode. And seems we're going to be helping the people in this church. Um, during, I guess, Act 2. Looking forward to it, and again, I hope you are enjoying this series, and if you are, please do think about liking and subscribing. It really does help me out a lot, and uh, yeah, I hope to see you in the next video. See ya.